YouTube, what's good? It's your boy, Brandman17. Coming at y'all with a new video today, you know what I'm saying? By the title, y'all can see we got the Smith & Wesson M&P Show Plus. Got the sick-ass New York Knicks fitted cap on. It's been sick as fuck. Let y'all see that real quick. It's been sick. If you ain't got one, you want one so sick. But yeah, the Smith & Wesson M&P Show Plus, I feel like at this point, I feel like I put enough rounds through it. So I feel like I have a pretty good opinion of it. And my opinion of it is if you don't have one, if you don't have you a Smith & Wesson M&P Shield Plus, I don't know what you're waiting for, go ahead and get you one. Uh, I carry mine's appendix. Tactical Scorpion Gear Holster, you already know. I uh, got this bitch off Amazon for like 20 bucks, maybe 25, I don't know. Uh, the Amber Ride one, that one was like 40, but I didn't like it. It wasn't a good holster for me, so I got rid of it. The Bravo Concealment, again, I didn't like it. And got rid of it. Uh, that one I got for about 25 off eBay. Sold both of them on eBay just because, like, I didn't have a use for them. Uh, and, yeah, they just weren't the holster for me. But the Tactical Scorpion gear, whenever I'm going with just the just the Shield Plus, no extra mags, this is what I rock. When I go with the Shield Plus and I got the extra mag, I use my Tier 1 Concealment holster, you know what I'm saying? It's a good holster. I like it. That's why I narrowed it down to these two. So yeah, but to the firearm. Again, tactical scorpion gear. We are clear. Our magazine is empty. There is no rounds chambered. No ammunition near. Clear as day. Again, this this hole empty. The shield plus is empty. But uh, yeah, this gun right here. I like to run it with a 13 round magazine. As you can see, that 13 rounds it gives you a nice a nice grip on it. Very nice grip. Uh, yes, this gun is on the smaller side of firearms, but like the way it handles, the way it feels, it's just like, it's just, it's nice. Like it's nice. I got big ass hands too. As you can see, big ass hands. This bitch could really like fit in my damn hand. Plus if you take the mag out, if you want the 10 round mag, the 10 round flush fit, this bitch damn near like that hook could just go in the pocket. You know what I'm saying? Just real simple. Boom. But would I rock it with jump shorts in my pocket? Probably not. I highly doubt it. Unless I'm just fucking taking the dog out or some shit. But, but yeah, back to the firearm. Uh, we can talk about the sights real quick. The sights. Uh, you have steel sights. Three dot white sights. Uh, I want to upgrade these. I will say that. Because I'm taking it to the range. And like the eye protection that I use. I just use regular sunglasses. I don't have like clear lens glasses. I have some, but I just don't take them with me when I go to the range. Cause I just use the glasses that's in my car. You know what I'm saying? But uh, it's I guess it's a little hard to pick up. Like when you uh, with the with the sunglasses. That's what I'm saying. Get the clear lens ones. That white dot at the front. It'll be easier to pick up. Like when I don't have glasses on, when I'm practicing, which you need to practice every single day. My practice is good, but when I got to the range yesterday, the lane they had me on. It was next to, it was right next to the wall. So the wall is dark. So, I mean, there wasn't as much light for my glasses to pick up, but which is cool. Like I told y'all, I'm gonna just rock the clear lenses next time. But the sights, steel sights, you can't go wrong with them. Do you have to replace them? No, you don't. If I wanted to keep these sights, could I keep them? Yes, I could, but I don't wanna keep them. So I'm not gonna keep them, simple as that. Uh, Next, we got the trigger. As you know, Shield Plus, amazing trigger. We are clear. Just again, let y'all see that. We are clear. We're clear as day. The trigger, let's get to it. Uh, the trigger, flat face trigger. Very nice wall. Clear break. Can't go wrong with that. Again, I'll show y'all like this here. I'll point it down just so it's a safe direction. Boom, there's the wall. Let me go with the left hand. Boom, there's the wall. Break, see if we get some reset. Audible click, boom, you there. Very nice trigger, amazing trigger, I'll say that. Uh, this trigger, bro, like, it's better than a Glock trigger from what I've seen on the internet. You know, I'm gonna get that Glock 45, that'll be my next pickup, but I thought I was gonna get it this month, but decided not to. Probably just wait a little bit longer, save up a little more, you know what I'm saying? But yeah. The trigger is nice, the sights are nice, the mag release, I'll show you that real quick. Got my empty mag in there, mag release is right here. 
it's right there the thumb sometimes you gotta adjust it like i told you i got big ass hands it's not a full-size gun so sometimes yeah you do have to adjust it but it's just it's practice like with my big ass hands i can't fucking point my thumb curve that bitch and fucking hit that bitch like that i gotta i gotta hit that hood with like this part of my thumb right here let me know what part of the what part of uh y'all finger y'all hit that bitch with i hit that hoe with this part here boom it drops out real simple boom 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 nice trigger release or not trigger release mag release might be we're on a one take drake shit i ain't going back and fixing that but mag release it's on point uh let's see take down i'll show you the i'll show you the take down real quick it's real simple Again, make sure that bitch is clear. It's clear. All you gotta do, rack that bitch back like that. This slide right here, and this little that lever. You want that pointed down. Then you can go here, and then just boom, come straight off. Real simple. Uh, I need to clean this. I'll probably clean this at some point today. Probably make a cleaning video on it. It's real simple. I got a cleaning video, so if you haven't seen that, go check it or subscribe. Wait for that new one to drop. But yeah, put it back on. All you gotta do, align the things. You wanna align this bottom part here. You wanna align that with your top. Let's see if I can hit that hoe on my first try. Boom. Like so. Turn back this way. Raise that bitch up. This lever here needs to be there. You can release the slide and you're good to go. Function check, boom. Again, boom. Still works. And yeah, that's the trigger. I showed y'all the sights, showed y'all the mag release, showed y'all how to take it down. Uh, the Smith & Wesson that I got, it came with the safety. Nice, simple safety. Real simple, real convenient. If you don't want to use the safety, don't get the one that got the safety on it. Or if you have the one that had the safety on it and you don't want to use the safety, don't use the safety, bro. It's like, it's that simple. It ain't gonna get in your way or nothing. It's in a nice, convenient place. Uh, don't have to worry about flicking it up. Flicking it down is super simple. So if you got that bitch on, you got that bitch on safe, all you gotta do, draw, boom, it's off. Draw, it's off. That's simple. But I keep it on just because, you know, I just do. You do you, I'm gonna do me. It's that simple. But uh, yeah, the slide, you got a steel slide. The barrel, I suppose I could show y'all that real quick. Should have showed y'all that when I just did the first takedown, but the barrel. Uh, standard Smith & Wesson 9mm barrel. It's real nice. I fucks with it. I think it's a great firearm. If you don't have one, I would say go ahead and get you one. Save you a few bucks. Get you one. I paid like 550 for mines. Should I pay that much? Probably not, but I did. It is what it is now. I ain't tripping about it. You shouldn't be tripping about it either. If you know where to get a better deal at, drop it down below so the people watching this video so they can know where they can get a good deal at. Uh, if y'all want, I can make a video like showing y'all my process to finding new guns, where I go to purchase my guns, and the stuff like that. It's real simple. If y'all want to subscribe, Go ahead, subscribe to your boy. I hope y'all enjoyed this review. Uh, you got any comments? Drop them down below. Trolls, if y'all got anything to say, drop it down below. And uh, yeah, I hope y'all enjoying y'all Friday. Hope y'all had a good week. I'm about to go hit the gym. If y'all ain't been to the gym all fucking week, get your ass there. Don't know what you're waiting for. Uh, Shit don't work unless you do. You feel me? Shit don't work unless you do. Uh, so yeah, if you don't have a Shield Plus, get you one. I'll probably make another video. This one went on a little long. It is what it is. Uh, I enjoy making this video for y'all. I hope y'all enjoy watching it. If you want to subscribe to your boy, go ahead. You know where I'm at, Brandman17. What's up? Get at me. What's up? Subscribe to the channel. Uh, make sure y'all keep coming back. Keep watching Brandman17. I'll see you on this video. I'm out.